poor guy. All of his co-workers were gone. What could, what it, could mean? it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. The lounge was grand, majestic, perhaps, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the I first open to hear door that. on his yeah, left. Can't go back now. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not but in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no <laughs> one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley wrong. decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. I feel like there's supposed to be different dialogue for that one. When you get on the platform and kill yourself. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Hang on the platform Perhaps for a few he seconds. wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. And here it was. The lounge. What a room, himself. What a room. Room. This is what Stanley thought. What a room. What a room. What a room. What, what a room. room. What a room. What a room. Va va voom. Va va voom. What a room. What a room. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. And not for yourself. Stop. But in his eagerness to prove that right, he is in control that. of the story <laughs> and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. Just a step through this door, Stanley thought to himself, that's all I need. If I can make it through this door, I can make it through them all. Hold on, I have an idea. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. It's been a well. bit since I've Perhaps watched he wanted to stop by the place for the Stanley first, Parable on YouTube. Just to admire it. It was okay. It was okay? It was okay. But when eager I to get back to I business, remember. Stanley took the first open door on his left. There being something else. With that platform. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Uh -huh. Oh well, look who's got cold feet. Sorry to break it to you, Stanley, but that lift isn't coming back. You'd best either get comfortable right here on this platform, or test your luck by jumping to the floor below. You know what? Looking at it now, it's not that far to the bottom floor. I bet you can make it. Yeah, it's not that far. Lean on the Come truck. on, I'm sure you'll survive the jump. Don't tell me you're scared. That's not the Stanley I know. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. I'll do a flip. Whew. Onto the truck. Ah! Whoops, looks like I was wrong. How clumsy of me. <laughs> Already this was uncomfortable, and Stanley decided that as soon as he found a new space he felt safe in, that he would never leave it again in his life. New content. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. 
Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Admire it this? Okay. It was okay. <laughs> but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you. <laughs> really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Now listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. Through the red door. Aha, perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked through the red door. I still don't think we're communicating properly. Another blue Stanley door. Forgot about this. Through the red door. Nope. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. You see, there's nothing here. I haven't even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you had wanted? Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? What did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Work with me. You've given me absolutely nothing so far. I'll tell you what. I want to be like a Yakuza take a game. stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. Mm. Oh, well, now this is useful. You didn't like it, but you didn't totally hate it either. You enjoyed right. it, perhaps yeah. is the correct term. I mean, it yeah. didn't cause you excruciating pain. True. Big steps we've made here today, Stanley. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. The fuck? <laughs> Old wide leaderboard. Where am I? There I am. Ouch. That's <laughs> so sad. True. <laughs> A dead rat. I'm trying my best here, okay? Now, would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, honest answers, please. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and really? now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. In this game, the oh. baby crawls left towards danger. It's you click the button to move him back to the right, and if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaningful game, all about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demise.
aspects of family life, I think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So right. why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. I could play this with it for four hours, but I'm not going to. He's getting closer. Oh, we almost made it. Oh, so close. Bye bye, baby. You heartless bastard. <laughs> Did you do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me? Because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your That's input was play. extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Let's see. What do we have here? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. Well, uh -huh. Firewatch! Fascinating. What do you think this game is about, Stanley? What's our backstory? What is our motivation? Hmm. Well, it seems obvious to me that you are meant to play as a creepy man spying on innocent civilians below you from up high in your creep tower. Perhaps for some sort of twisted erotic purpose. Hmm. Yes, that must be it. What a fascinating venture into the experience of total mental depravity. So far, I love everything about this game, Stanley. And it seems there's even more. Come, let's venture outward and see what else is out there. May 1989. <clears throat> Good Firewatch. It definitely wasn't Firewatch the first time around. <laughs> it was Minecraft. Oh no. No, 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 it can't be. What? It is. It's an open world game. Good God, yeah. quickly, block it off. What? Hey. Oh, thank goodness, Stanley. What a close call. You nearly wandered off into that, that thing, that big open <laughs> Just wandering around, no right or wrong directions, no path to follow. You can just go in any... Oh, oh thank heavens we avoided it. We're out of the woods now, Stanley. Okay, I'm going to get us out of here. Let's find another game. Preferably something with walls. Something with nice, big, insurmountable walls. Must mm -hmm. we through. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think this will be just the thing. What? Wonderful. See, this is exactly what I had in mind. Just a nice big box for you to run around in. There isn't any possibility that you could get lost here. Now this is game design. Stanley, if you manage to get lost in this game, I will be phenomenally impressed. We kill ourselves? Okay, yeah. so what exactly do we do here? Let's see. There are lots of cars here in the back, but obviously there's no racetrack. Okay, I'm seeing that there's a ball of some kind back here. Is this game sports ball? Stanley, sports I think ball? it's sports ball. Oh, what fun. We shall run the bases and do a touchdown together. Yes, <laughs> I think surely we must. Okay, Stanley, here's the ball. Have fun. Oh. Oh shit, you move a lot faster now. Get over there. Yeah. Oh. Hold on. What are you doing? <laughs> Stanley, don't do that. I can't follow you there. I can't help you. How will you do? You can't do it. You know that. Stanley, come back.
Ó. Oh. In the Half Life 2 mod. It's so cool. <laughs> it's the two doors. Family's office. Oh, look at this. Oh, the Half Life 2 mod. <laughs> Wait, that was turned there? Oh. I wonder what he found. If what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it. Down in wherever he is right now. I wonder if he's happy with his choice, and if he's learned the heavy cost that comes with it. He'll understand soon what I was trying to tell him. He needs me. Someone who will wrap everything up at the end. To make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. That's who I am. That is what I mean to this world. Oh, yes. Yes, I'll be back. There's no other way. Once this ends, after it all comes to a close, then I'll be back. The end will be here soon. Very soon. I can wait. <laughs>